This is Game Edge, and we are back in Subnautica with a brand new update that came out not too long ago. And we are going to try it out, and we're going to see whether or not you guys are interested in this game again. Uh, let's get some thumbs up if you guys want to see a lot more of this. And again, this is a brand new update that occurred. We could do farming. We could do some extra builds. There's some wreckage. There's some octopus added. There's so much things that these guys are working on to add on. So I'd like to see if you guys are interested in this game. So again, hit a, th a likes if you like this kind of uh, game, if you want to see a little more of it. And we'll get building. We'll do a let's play on this. So again, it's all up to you guys. Please tell us what you think. Attention. up that's awesome much better intro the game this is much better oh oh whoa, whoa. oh there we go that's when you die that's it the game's over i'm just joking <laughs> shit a plate like that smack you in the head all right <laughs> all right so this start is a little rougher than usual uh, i got to test it just a little bit i went in and out to make sure everything was okay graphic wise uh when i started i realized we had absolutely nothing this kit opens up there's nothing in there so it's okay and here we actually just start off with water flares and nutrient blocks we've got a lot of work to get to what we need uh we, we really actually need is well for building wise we're going to actually have to get the uh, Habitat Builder, which is down here, and it needs computer chips and batteries. Uh, that's a lot of work to get rolling uh, without anything, but we're actually going to need this the most now. Silicon rubber and uh, titanium to get that rolling. So silicon rubber is pretty simple. Oh, simple-ish, as, as you can say. Uh, we need to get uh, some creep seed clusters here, so we need to get some of that. And hopefully... Uh, I wonder if we... Can we get that without a knife? I think so, yeah, of course, or else we wouldn't be able to build a knife. Yeah, of course, of course. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> this is a much different. I'm used to starting off with a little gadget for us to build things and all that, so it's pretty off. Let's get rolling, let's get going here. So we need titanium for sure, and a bunch of stuff. So let's get into the water. Captain, the new message has arrived. Playing message. Okay, so these messages do not play. I guess that's for future builds. Let's get into the water. Oh, pristine water. Can you see that? Pristine. Attention. Detecting increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent with ongoing degradation of the Aurora's dark matter drive core due to damage sustained during collision. Continuing to monitor. All right, in case you guys never seen this game before, uh, it is absolutely beautiful. I'm not going to go see it. It's incredible. Now, it's changed quite a bit. It's added a lot more. That's the Aurora. That was a ship we're in. This is our escape pod. And we are to build bases in the bottom here. We can farm now. There's so much we can do. So let's get going here. We need some titanium. Titanium, we can get it from scrap from the Aurora here. So this is all here. This is a salvage. We'll pick up some quartz too, because quartz is extremely handy. And here they're telling you what to do to start off here. Break some limestones. You just snap these up. Boom. There we go. We got some copper ore, which is very handy also. We're going to need that for later on. We have some titanium off that. This we can't break without a knife, which we're going to need for batteries and stuff, so. There we go. Should go and get some of these fishies. Uh, when the Aurora does, you know, if you've never seen it before, you'll see what's going to happen to the Aurora. It's not going to do very well very shortly, but we're going to need to get some food. And these sack fish get us water and food. You can make water or food with them. So you can cook them up or actually create water. They're water sack, so they have tons of it. I guess their filtration ability in their bodies. I don't know how it works, but let's grab a bunch of these guys. We can also put these pepper pepper fish or peeper fish? Peeper. I think it's peeper. Peeper probably pick picked the pepper pepper. It's really tough to find with it. There's fins. Oh shit. This is where we have to go anyway, so. I think it's here. We can't cut these without this. This is seeds, right? Seed clusters, yeah. Grab a couple of those just in case. We I didn't see how much we needed. Let's grab one more. Should be okay. We'll grab one more from here just to make sure. 
it doesn't hurt. We can make medkits of that stuff. Titanium. Did it tell us a cluster beforehand? I didn't. I just realized that. I usually don't know what it is. If it tells you a cluster beforehand, that's awesome. Yeah, these guys gotta be careful. The acid. They're not vicious as long as you don't go near them. Break limestone. No, it didn't tell us to. Copper ore that we're gonna need. Oh, look how beautiful this game is. Oh, it just keeps on getting more and more beautiful. There's some more titanium right here. Oh, you little shit. Where'd you go? Uh, okay. You should be able to dig sand too. You can dig through the sand and, and the base. Uh, pretty much, when you pull the bilge base, it actually pretty much cuts through the sand for you. You can dig out your own area if you want. Emergency. There's a lot of areas. 10 seconds of oxygen remaining. Oh, you lucky bastard. We're going to head back to the ship and try and get ourselves a knife because we need to get some some stuff here. Okay. We'll grab that. We're going to need this for batteries, so we'll grab a couple of these. Tell's that. Oh, those guys. Okay. It's like little crabs, huh? Inventory is full. All right. Let's just go back. We have a full inventory. We can eat, at least. It's too bad they don't use a bar and a bottom. Oh, you change the look of the, uh, the life pod. It's nice. Message number two. Caution. Continued degradation of the Aurora's drive core may cause a quantum detonation. Calculating risk assessment. Death by malnourishment, 7%. By physical injury, 11%. By exposure to radioactive crash site materials, 19%. If the drive core is breached, probability of death increases to 65%. Wow, she's full of joy isn't she all right we're actually this is actually the salvage as we're gonna do that while we're doing that uh, i'm pretty sure and i'm mistaken the silicon and rubber used to be quartz but now it makes more sense to get something else i never thought there you know i didn't think quartz can become rubber silicon rubber but it was it's okay we can make this we keep on slipping what the hell now i moved everything over here okay well I'll just make as much as we can there you go Okay, now we're going to go down to our knife. We should be able to have enough for our knife, at least. Right. Tools, knife. This is uh, an air bladder, so chemical reaction produces uh, lighter than air gas, the personal buoyancy, so it actually shoots you back up, if I'm not mistaken, so I never actually made it, to tell you the truth. That's okay. All right, so cool. We got our knife. Uh, next step, what do we need here? Well, we're going to have to eat, because we're looking at 33 in food here on the left-hand side, and water is a 65. All right, let's cook this up. Let's get some water. We'll take one of the fish for water. I hate the slotting part. That's gotta be fixed. Uh, cook fish. We have some water and the other things, so we're just gonna make sure we have enough food. It does go bad, so you can't make too much. I'm sorry about the slotting. Nothing I can do. This is something the developers need to work on, not anything I can stop. See if I sign straight, I'm fine. It's all good. All right, so cool. Let's open up our inventory. Let's eat this up. And this one gives you the air sac one. Uh, gives you six, 15 food and three water. So that's cool. The peeper fish uh, and a boomerang are a lot better. So I'm not mistaken. Get some more water. And we'll dump the rest in here. Okay, well, knife. We need, That takes some storage space, sure. Yeah, that takes some space. Let's just drop this in there. Uh, titanium. So we're gonna go get some more shit here. More water, quartz, copper. Okay, we're gonna have to watch out not to fill up too much. We actually have to build something out of this, so let's gonna double check again. It's, what was it we needed again for that thing? A computer chip and a battery. Okay, so the batteries are over here, I'm mistaken. Where are they again? They're here. Batteries are two acid mushroom and copper ore. So we got the copper ore. Uh, two acid mushroom. Wait a second. Didn't I just get those? We didn't have enough space. Okay, let's start off with the battery then. Wait, the computer chip is wet while we're down there. So we don't have to go back and forth. Well, we need to build a computer chip again. Where are you? Uh, it's over here again. Computer chip is going to be table coral sample. So we actually have a knife that we can use that. Silver ore and quartz. Okay, so silver ore is going to be a bitch to find. 
Uh, it's near the actual, uh, those monsters I showed you. Oh, it's just got dark. Damn it. We're gonna be careful how much inventory we carry. Warning, local okay. radiation readings exhibit characteristics consistent with total degradation of the Aurora's dark matter drive core. A quantum detonation will occur with a probability of 85.5%. Advise observing a one kilometer safety range. Nice. Wow, look at that plant. That's beautiful. Okay, we need some coral. There we are. Four, let's say. I think that's a good common coral sample. There we go, that should be enough. We want to overdo it. What is this? Purple fan. That's very nice. Now again, with a farm, you can actually create quite a bit of stuff. You actually can create design-wise. Uh, there's also planters and stuff. There's desks, there's chairs. Uh, so in other words, the base is actually going to be real base down. So we'll actually be able to create something and actually have some kind of design work inside, which can be kind of cool. Okay, the silver ore, we're not going to find it here. We have to go down deeper. You know, the creep vines. Where are these? They're over here somewhere. Usually it's off an edge somewhere. These guys are harmless. That's a message, but again, the message has nothing. I'm sorry about the darkness, too. Usually, you know, the light, you know, once we have a, that, we can have a flashlight. We also have a Seamoth, which will make a vehicle, which we can go into the depths of here a lot faster, and it's gonna make it a lot quicker. Again, building a base is really cool, and then going out and really doing the investigation and trying to search out things, and building a better base uh, is gonna be really imperative in this. And I can't wait to see what we can do. Now that we have the tools to do it, it was really fun, but, oh shit, this could be hard to go down there. Look how long it takes us to go down. Fresh air. Let's see if we can do it. We just gotta find some silver, and silver is usually down here somewhere. Uh, I'm not gonna bother with anything else right now. I'm just gonna try and find some silver ore. As you can find some rock face and stuff. We're gonna have to watch our air. We'll use 10% or 10 of it. There we go. Come on, something on a rock face. Now we're gonna have to go back up now. Emergency. Seismic readings suggest a quantum detonation has occurred. Emergency. Emergency. Drive 10 Four. seconds of the central domain of the reactor will reach a supercritical state. A T minus. Ten, oh, I don't want to miss this. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, three two. 2. Oh, here she goes. Holy shit. Even the sounds are really nice. The planet moving around it. Okay, we've got radiation here. Winds of radiation coming in. Okay. Well, that was it. She exploded. Look at the fish right in front of us, and they didn't touch it. Damn it. That's not a knife. This is a knife. Okay, this is a piece of fragments we need also a tool for. So, Seamoth fragment is exactly what we're looking for, these kind of fragments. Uh, they changed up the salt and stuff. I think those are salt now. We can see them more visually a lot better. And also the items themselves look a little different. I don't know what the silver looks like. They might have switched it up on us. You should be able to find a lot in the rock faces here. And I don't see very much of it. Again, it could be because it's nighttime. This is the salt, yeah. Okay. Salt. Ow, ow, ow! We just got bitten by that piece of shit. Oh man, that's not good. It's not the way you want to start. Emergency. My fault, I should look behind us. Alright, can the sun come back here? Because I need some uh, light to see what the hell we're doing here. Okay, that's not what I'm looking for again. Really, we really, really need is something on these rock faces that give us chip away at it. But it seems like they put a lot less. What the hell? Used to find this stuff, no problem. Yes, we can get some air. Is it letting us get air right away? 
See, look, it shows that bottom right. It's something you can investigate, I guess. Uh, but we don't have that tool yet. Uh, I was hoping to find some good shit here to at least start this up. Okay, I'm gonna have to go back up. Oh, there's some right there. I see it. That could be silver. Cut creep fine. I guess we could do that. Right after I chip away that, we'll ch cut the creep vine and make them all happier. Again, this is like a tutorial uh, basis. They always start you off like that uh, to cut the creep vine. There we go. Okay, everybody's happy. Oops, wrong one. We get silver, baby. I remember the silver was around here. Silver. Come on, just one more would be nice. Oh, there she is. Copper. All right, copper is still Emergency. very useful. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. All right, I'll swim it. I'll swim it. Three. Oh, sure, we're gonna choke. Oh, that came close. That came effing close. All right. There we go. I know a lot of you were asking me to play this, and you know what? I, I decide what the heck. I had my little tester go at it and uh, was given two thumbs up. That uh, the update was phenomenal, so appreciate her help. Titanium. Silver art. Okay, that's good enough for now. Let's get start. Emergency. 10 seconds of oxygen remaining. Please, no one kill me. We get some fish on our way back here. Sorry, I'm keeping quiet. I'm just waiting to. S oh, oh, we're blacking out. Oh, we're blacking out. Okay. We're gonna have to be careful for that. I want to see what happens after that. I just die, and that's it. Lose everything we just found. Come here, little shit. There we go. We need to eat by the time we get back. And I really like these fish because the water value with it. Oh, you little crap. You little shit. It seems to be easier to catch at night. Do these things fall asleep at night? Because it seems like that's what they do. Hey, hey. Got some room in my stomach. Emergency. For you. 10 seconds of oxygen remaining. And also, you can go up on the top here if you want to. See, we're on top. The animation's not there yet. And just go down, bam. Okay, we're just gonna take care of that really quick. There's nothing there. Poor fish. All right, uh, we can do is make, I don't know if we've got these. We're all 58 in water. We should be okay if we eat these. We also have a couple of bottles of water left, so. Stop sliding. Okay, if there's another one like this, we'll put water. Oh, a nice bottle of water. God, that slide has got to stop. I hope that doesn't happen when we build our base. My God, I, we've kind of picked up a lot of these suckers, eh? Okay, well, we're not going to be, uh... We're not going to be running out of food anytime soon. There we go, we're full. Water. I actually took quite a bit. Maybe a little too much in my opinion, but it's okay. Alright, so. Oh man, that slide is irritating that shit. I mean. We gotta get our stuff. Table coral sample. What? Table coral sample. Oh, I got the wrong one. I got common, right? Yeah. That's shit we don't need right now. Alright, table coral sample. I know what it looks like, but I just gotta find it. There she is. See? Red. You have to pick it up right after it drops, so. Uh, we'll just do one more. Hello? Stuck? There we go. That should be enough. Let's get our asses back into it. 
There we go. Whew. Man, talk about survival. You have nothing to start with. That's what I'm talking about. All right. Um. Oh, yeah, the copper wire. Cool. Okay, let's get the computer chip going. Excellent. Barry need the acid mushrooms, which are happened to be in a little chest right here. Because we picked them up, didn't we? We did, didn't we? We did not. We did not. No. I thought we did, didn't we? That's really strange. I was pausing. Here they are. Not as if we have to go very far. Two, three, four. Everybody's happy. There we go. That didn't take very long. That's what I'm talking about. Oops, right over here. Uh, acid mushroom uh, times two and copper. There we go. So we have the computer chip and that to give us what we need here for Habitat Builder. Beautiful. Very proud of building it. All right. We got our Habitat Builder. That's awesome. Okay, so our next step is really, well, first of all, let's, let's check this baby out. Because now we actually can build all these cool shit here. So we can actually start building our, our bases. We want to. We need platforms and stuff, which are foundation here. It takes four of our titanium. And we also have uh, the multi-purpose rooms, which will take... See, base room blueprint. I guess it starts off with it. Didn't know we had it. They also added here large aquariums, uh, which are really, really cool. Which you can actually put together here with uh, the hatch, which actually you can go inside and swim and drop the fish off. And there's other major builds we can do afterwards, which are further into the game and with the fine blueprints for us. So there's, they'll add on as they go through here. And as this game progresses, the developers obviously are adding on too. We'll build a farm and a whole bunch of cool things here. Uh, even have ladders and it was really awesome. Okay, so we're just gonna start off with putting at least our base down. I'd like to finish the episode before that, at least see what our base looks like. Uh, we can actually hot swap some of this shit out. We'll come back to that. We'll take some of this. Rotten. We're gonna drop that anyways. What was it med kit again? I forget. Where's the med kit on this thing? Did they change the symbol on one of these, or did it, may I just forgotten where the hell it is? Or is this something we just haven't found yet? It's the more advanced. Electronics, advanced materials, and basic materials. So yeah, I think we don't, we can't build this yet. Funny, because usually there's another symbol over here that actually tells us where we can put our health kits and stuff. So yeah, that must be what it is. Okay, cool. So let's just drop this shit in there. Anything we don't want, we'll just throw it out. I'll just eat the son of a bitch before he rotten. It becomes rotten. Okay, so that's cool. That's good. Some more quartz. go. So look our rubber in case they need it. Uh, nutrient blocks we can pick up back up here. This is not going to explode right now so let's get going to find a place we're going to lay down our base. Preferably away from those sons of bitches and the creeper vines. Okay. Be a good place to build our initial base. Coral is over there. It's in the way. <laughs> Like to build in a decent place that we're gonna actually build to do a nice job of building some serious room, but I think that'd be that direction. So there, you're look up for some quartz. We're gonna need that for the build, anyways. Here's some quartz over here. I think I mentioned it. Quartz is imperative. Oh yeah, drop, right click, right click. Get rid of that shit for now. Yeah, just kind of leaves it there like that. Little boxes. I don't know if it sh stays there for how long, but it's okay. We need to get a scanner for this too. So we can actually pick up this. So this will be a sea moth, I guess, again. Sea moth fragment. We need that big time. We get too close to that ship, but this would be. Ooh, look at this place. That's beautiful. That is beautiful. Oh shit! No, no, don't kill me! Well, fuck me. Excuse the language. And there's nothing inside? Ah. Oh. Well, that scared the shit out of me, I'll be honest with you. 
Alright, we're gonna run out of air. Holy shit, hello. Oh my god, don't kill me, 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 don't kill me. Oh! Son of a bitch! Well, I got some crash power after all. We're gonna need to get a health kit though. That limits us from doing too much. Oh, I almost got you, little bum. Give me dinner. Okay, we gotta build something and we'll start building here. Yeah, let's start building here. This is actually very beautiful. Lots of room. Let's just put a foundation down and get rolling. Not that we can build a secondary base anyways. It's not a big, big deal. But I think this location anyways is pristine. It's near all the big stuff we need to. We can expand out to the faults over there. Which are going to be kind of cool. Okay, let's right click on this and put our foundation down. Alright. There was like a little glitch that occurred there. It's kind of froze when I chose foundation. Alright, cool. Uh, let's put this down. Can we put up higher or no? Okay, let's start off with that one. So let's take up our titanium. I'm going to take the materials from us through this and add it to this. So the foundation will add some strength to the building, which is what you want. Because we got windows and stuff. You want to keep it nice and strong, and this will add some strength to it. So it's pretty cool. Oops. All right, so see two hit points on that, baby. Okay, let's build this. All right, it still does the center, eh? Let me build a secondary. There we go. This here is not far. Okay, at least we can build something nice here. Might need some more titanium out of this. We're out of titanium. Yeah, we're out of titanium. Whoops, press the wrong button. There's some titanium right here. We'll go and get that done. This one here. There's so much of this shit around, so we should be okay. Get some more there. Let's get some air. And that one happened all the time. Sooner or later, we'll be able to really live underneath the water and uh, get our materials and stuff we need. We don't have to pop it in and out of the water afterwards. So just the beginning of the game, don't get all freaked out about it, but that's what's gonna happen for a little bit until we actually build our base and start getting the materials we need to start building a, you know, a better a better overall base, as you'd say, and also a more equipment so we can actually change our equipment up and get a better rebreather. Oh, there it is. Let's get some more titanium here real quick. Titanium. Go. We need a health kit big time. Got nothing. Huh? Okay, I thought we caught one. It's true. We did not catch one. See, now it's not all complete. I took the materials, but it didn't put it all the way through. So you can left click or E to just construct. You can actually remove these things. Same thing here, you can actually take them out. So that's really cool. Alright, so right click on this. And let's put down our first base, piece of base. I think that's a good place to start. Come on. There we go. And we'll put a hatch. We're on this baby here. We can move these things around so you're not stuck. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. One second. What did it say we're missing? Quartz or...? Glass. Glass. Okay, well, we have quartz. Oh, how come I forgot about the glass? Because it has that. Forgot! Right here, and the quartz itself, so it takes two quartz for one glass. We'll just build two for now. Just to make sure we have some stuff. It's gonna get dark soon. go and then we have to build solar panels they let us do it right away or we have to find now we do have to find it eh? so there's no power to this baby or is it just generated power now welcome aboard captain that was kind of cool all right so it limits us what we can do actually to start off with even a chest and stuff we're gonna have to find oh no chests are here okay good 
So we need a fabricator on here. We're gonna put one on the wall over here in the middle. There's zero power in this base. That's really strange. I remember that we would build that. There's a power. So we actually have had to find those things. Okay, so next episode, we're going to have to go into this and start finding all the stuff we need for the... Well, we have to find actual, I guess, the blueprints for those. Wow, that is incredible. All right, so again, if you guys want to see more of this and you want to see the building of this base, you want to see the farming and everything else going to go on, the new creatures, uh, the shipwrecks, and a whole bunch of other cool things we can find, please hit the thumbs up. Please be involved in it and uh, watching it. And again, it's just a matter of views and, and likes. If you guys don't like it, I'm not going to start posting it for no reason. I work on other games. So again, it's all up to you guys if you want to see more of this cool game and see what we can build. We can actually now decor the interior, build the outside, farm, a whole bunch of cool things. I think it's worth a shot. And I really appreciate you guys spending time and watching it right to the end. You guys are awesome. This is the Edge for Game Edge. I'll catch you guys on the flip side.